Hello, I'm Father Timothy Matkin with the Rector's Rambling for September 1st, 2019. And today I'm posing the question, can you be a bad Catholic? Well, I'll tell you how this came about. Picture the scene, quote, I know I'm a bad Catholic, but I just disagree. And that was basically the comment that I heard from someone objecting to a church teaching. But what struck me is not so much the objection as the term bad Catholic. And it occurred to me that while Romans, Roman Catholics, may use the term that way, as far as I've heard, we Anglicans never do. So what's behind that? In fact, I noticed just the other day uh, that a former colleague of mine who swam the Tiber uh, when talking about some dissident theologians like uh, Charles Curran or Hans Kung, I, I can't remember who it was, um, my friend asserted, quote, they're not even Catholics. I knew what he meant, and for the first time it really clicked and it clarified how the term has been employed differently among us. For them, basically, as far as I can tell, Catholic has evolved into a brand. Someone is a Catholic because his or her specific church membership. And if that person does not accept or even explicitly rejects the Catholic faith, that person is still somehow described as a Catholic, only perhaps with the clarifier bad or dissident or something like that. On the other hand, for us, Anglicans, while we certainly recognize that one becomes a Catholic by being incorporated into Christ, into his mystical body, the church, by being baptized, we usually employ that term in a different way. It's not a brand name, except sometimes used, unfortunately, as a party label among us. But rather, when we use it, it's a description of genuine Christianity. That's what's being emphasized and communicated. And if it's a description of genuine Christianity, that means it's, it's always earned. We would not describe Jack Spong or, or uh, James Pike as bad Catholics. In fact, I've never even heard them described as bad Episcopalians. For us to claim the name Catholic is to say that we adhere to the truth of Christianity in all of its total fullness. It's not a bit here and a bit there. It is to say that whatever reservations or difficulties we may have with doctrinal or moral tenets of the church, we lay those at the foot of the cross. It means that we recognize the right of the church to be our mother and our teacher. It means that we hold the Catholic faith, that believed everywhere, always, and by all. And so I want each one of us to claim that name, Catholic. But most of all, I want it to be a description rather than just a label. I want it to be always a name that is earned. I'm Father Timothy Matkin. If you're in Dallas, come join us at St. Francis Anglican Church. And you can look us up on the web at stfrancisdallas.org. Please like and share, and we will see you there. God bless.